We're going to thank quarterback, uh, great athlete Ben Collier for joining us up here in the press box after a, a real tough defeat out there. But 27 carries, 162 yards. You had a great night offensively running the football. Talk yes, a little bit about how that worked. Well, they moved me back to quarterback. We run a lot of jet sweep, read option. You know what I'm saying? Yes, they sir. know I'm good with pulling the ball, making good uh, reads. Sure. And I hit the hole hard, and I got speed. So once I see that, when I see the defenders move over, right. I hit right behind them, follow my uh, block. Well, that's what you have to do. That's what you guys work on. And, and uh, uh, talk a little bit about what you were seeing defensively. What were those guys doing that you knew that you could do quite well at tonight? Because obviously you were very good. Well, when we have uh, put trips to the left or trips <laughs> to the right, <laughs> they will move everybody to the trip side, okay. and they'll just leave one linebacker over to the other side. So our coach seen it, and we uh, call a play to the uh, outside because I'm – Good with speed, sure. so I can beat them to the outside. Yes, sir. I ride Carl, Carl's Hunter, and I pull it and read. Well, and I get 10 carries, 10 carries probably for like 30 yards every time. Yeah, you had a great night running the football, and uh, uh, there's no doubt that, that you put a spark back in the offense that we haven't, maybe haven't seen recently. And listen, we come up a little short. We've got to keep working. So as, as one of the senior leaders, well, what, do you, what do you tell the rest of the guys we've got to do? Well, number one thing is confidence and they don't believe we can win. We got basically a young team. Sure. They um, some of them scared to tackle, and some of them really don't get in at practice. Right. So it basically be mostly seniors. Right. And a couple of juniors that's really doing the thing. Right. And then when it's time for them to get in, they don't do what they're supposed yeah. to do. Yeah. Coach well, told them. To yeah. Well, no doubt. Do. I mean, everybody's got to work hard at it. You got to work hard at it. We got three games left, and of course, the goal is always to make the playoffs. You yes, will have to win two out of the next three, and and it doesn't get any easier than that. But uh, I mean, we're going to be on the road for the next couple of weeks, and then we get to play Southside at home. So uh, uh, I would guess that you guys are going to prepare and keep working hard, just like we expect you Greyhounds to do. Yes, sir. We have to move forward. Work hard. Put this behind us after tonight. Absolutely. Ben Carr, you had a great night running the football. He had a great night playing safety for the Hounds, and we appreciate him taking time to join us. And uh, Subway and the Walmart Supercenter always brings you the Coach Hansley show at the end of the broadcast. And, uh, Coach, it's one of those football games that we thought was going to be a hard-fought football game. We thought it'd be tooth and nail. And and uh, we had a quarter there in the second quarter. Things didn't go real well, but 33-20, to 20, we come up short again. But, uh, w once again, we, we're going to have to find some ways to win. Yeah, and uh, we did. We went into half, and, and, you know, the goal was, hey, we're down 24-12, I think, at that time. I said, you know, this game's right now. We made some adjustments defensively. Uh, we talked about what we did offensively that we liked, what we want to continue to do, what we could tweak, what, you know. And I felt good going out of half that we, you know, had a, had a, had a plan that I thought we could we could be good with. Sure. Um, you know, we 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 played a little bit better in that third quarter, and then just you just couldn't couldn't just couldn't keep it up in the fourth. Uh, you know, and Darian got out of thing. He he got hurt there. I saw it. You know, beginning of the fourth. So, uh, you know, ho hopefully he can. Be back ready to go because he's a he's a big time player for it. Yes, sir, he is. Coach, talk a little bit about you know we were up here in the broadcast and as the game flows and you have you have different turning points and different momentum swings. Our defense came out and made a couple of big stops when we had to make stops and 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 got got the football back for our offense. We couldn't do much with it, but but defensively, I thought in the second half you guys made those proper yeah, adjustments. Yeah, we did. You know, and and that's you know. It's almost like you know we went from a four down front to a three down front right. in the second half, and it and it didn't make a lot of difference because you know we kind of went back to that same philosophy we want to try with Lono, even though Lono can he were a different monster. Sure, sure. We tried it. We tried a philosophy that we we thought we could we could be better at, and and uh, with three down linemen sending the guy, twisting the guy, and all that kind of sure. stuff. So, you know, trying to get a little bit of pressure, but still being able to pl play some 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 concepts behind there that we. Because you know we tried to lock him up in man, and we we just kept getting giving up the deep ball, and we knew we had to go to some type of zone, and we still needed to want to send pressure. So you know we we tried different things in that third quarter that that did work. We just uh, you know we you still got to be fresh. You know we sure. just, we, we we just lost our gas a lot of times because right. we were switching in and out. Because I mean the same dudes play back to back. back so to that, yeah. you know uh, and, and and we did and, and you know you mean know, Ben. I mean my goodness that kid. Played hard. I, didn't I, he? I mean there was no question. You know after we got done I said you know Ben you're the guy come on let's go and. I mean, he played hard. I sure. mean, when we wanted a spark on offense, you give it to ten. That's and so that's you know that's what he's doing all night. We were trying to use Carl to his advantage, right? Just, sure. You know, you know, bullet out Carl or, or you know or, or send him in mode. We're trying to do things to keep their eyes, but still, Ben was the key. You know, we're trying to get Ben the ball. Coach, I want to say this about that football team. We talked about how hard they played. In the first half, I mean, it just seemed like that every play that they needed to make, they had 
perfect execution. They hit a lot of passes that we covered pretty well. They just perfected their execution. And when you're doing that, they're hard to stop. Anybody's hard to stop. You know, I'm perfect. telling you, it, it's – they always give us a game. Yeah. My goodness, they give <laughs> us a game. I, I just don't understand. They, there'd be times that I would call a zone idea, a zone concept on the back end, our secondary. Right. And they'd find a hole. Right. We would call a man blitz, and they would know. They know they would just see the blitz coming and just dump it overhead to a guy. Yes, they sir. always had a check down guy. They you know they know who we are, and they always had a check down guy for our man coverages. You know for our for our blitz and the man coverage, and they always had a. I mean, they were prepared. They were prepared, and and. You know, they always had an answer, and I think when we come out in the second half, we did something they really didn't hadn't, hadn't seen. I think that's what, you know, gave us a, a little bit of a fighting chance. But, you know, we just couldn't make plays. We need to make plays. Uh, you know, they kept getting that edge on us, and, and you know, we that that goes that comes down to our outside linebackers, and we just got to we gotta tighten them up. Well, you, you're going to have to win some conference games for us to uh, uh, look forward to that third season, and mm -hmm. I still have a lot of confidence in this football team. You have to win two of your next three to have a chance to get in because oh, you're not going to get two. in with two victories, but you have a chance to get in with three, and yeah. most unlikely if you do get, just say, for example, if you if you win, it doesn't matter, you win your next two, and, and uh, uh, we've talked about you, you want to beat those people who are behind you. You don't want to yeah. have a tiebreaker or something, but you don't have any control over that. So we're going to have to win some football games to get in, but – we did some things in the first half that I thought at, at this late stage of the game, I mean, we had a couple of penalties. We had a uh, – boy, it's just – I'm telling you. It, the, I mean, your face back penalties you can't do anything about. Those mouthing penalties you can do something yeah. about. But I do know this. Our kids fought hard. They continue to fight hard. We're going to find a way to get it done. Well, and, and, and you know, agree to disagree. We'll agree, agree with any of those those calls. I mean, it. they're just killers, man. Absolutely, they are. They killers, are. you know, and, and – the one that hurts the most is where it's fourth and five, and I'm screaming at the top of my lungs, please no. watch the ball. Yeah. Watch the ball. Because they're going to punt. Yeah, they're going to punt. They're going to punt. You know, they're going to punt. We, we talked about it all week. They're going to show an offensive formation. They're going to dead call you. He's going to take three steps back and quick kick it to the right. Absolutely. We we knew that. Yes, you know, sir. And, and <laughs> but, you know, it's easy to say that now. It is. But when you're out there playing, yeah. I've been there, done You've played. I've it, done it. it. <laughs> I've it's it. not that easy. We didn't mean to. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Coach, I was just trying to be aggressive. Well, yes, buddy, sir. I know. I yes, know. Yes, sir. So, you know, we, we just got to keep going to work and go and, and keep trying to figure out what we can do to beat the next opponent. Absolutely. You know, and, and and, and I'll, I'll give it to Carl. He's he coming there and, you know, tried to lead and said, you know, hey, keep your heads up, guys. we got to go for next week. Well, so, they're looking forward to it. That, 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 you got to appreciate absolutely. that about a bunch of kids. Yeah. You really can because they are trying. I mean, there's times when you, when they could have probably give more effort, but they're trying. And, and – you know they're under the pressure too. Sure. And and sure. and and you know for them to be ready to go to work for next week already. I mean they're they're they are they're they're fighting, and uh, you know we just we we got to pull it together, week in week out. And we we and and you know talking about winning, we really need to win this whole thing out Absolutely. in order to be yeah. secure. Yeah, it guarantees us a spot. Uh, yeah, because I mean we just you know when we start picking games that you can't do that. You no, gotta, no, we you, have got, you to need to win. win out. Wins yeah. are the only things that's going to get us yeah. anywhere Absolutely. right now. Well, let me take quickly now uh, going to Riverview. Yeah. And uh, that game might – not that it means any more to you than, than most games do, <laughs> yeah. but you got a buddy down there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Larry's down there. You know, and, and we, we – I talk to him every week, you know, and, and they're they're doing really good. Yes, sir, they are. They've got a pretty good little defensive stat. I haven't seen the score for Stuttgart tonight. I was really wanting to see that score. Hey, Randy, see but, if you've uh, seen the Stuttgart. No. But uh, I was kind of really looking forward to that to see kind of a measuring stick. Right. Uh, and, you know, that's that they're, they're going to be tough. I'm Absolutely. not going to lie to you. You know, and I've been watching CAC getting ready for – uh, Heber and uh, I'm telling you, CSC can chunk <laughs> yeah, the ball. I guarantee you they can chunk. Well, they we got just got to keep working. We got to keep working. Period. Period. We got to keep working. You Good know. to see you, my friend. Well, hey, it. listen. There's going to be some times this year, just like we did at Lone Oak, when we get to come up here and we get to talk about some victories for the Hounds. I'm telling you, I'm ready. I'm so ready. All right, my friend. Let's keep working. <laughs>